Let's do an experiment today. We are going to extract DNA from strawberries. For that we need some water. So I am taking some water in beaker. Next we are adding some salt to this water. So next we are adding detergent solution or soap solution to it. Then we want to mix it well. Okay, the salt as well as the dishwash liquid, it should mix it well. And we can keep it aside. Next, we can take a sip log bag. Then we are adding strawberries into it. I'm taking three strawberries. I'm just crushing it. So next, we are adding the prepared solution to this. Then we are crushing it. Let the strawberries and the solution get mixed well together. Then using a strainer, we are straining it. Okay, the so solution. Then we are taking the complete extract from the strawberries. Next, we are taking this solution. We are adding to this glass. Next comes the most repeated question in the previous years that is chilled ethanol. Okay, so what is the use of chilled ethanol here? Yeah, it is mentioned in NCRT, right? Okay, so this is used for the precipitation of DNA. So we added chilled ethanol to it. So can you see it is getting precipitated? The DNA it is getting precipitated inside this glass. So after that, what we are going to do is what is the method to take this DNA out from this glass? That is also mentioned here. That is by spooling. Okay. So we did the experiment. That is extraction of DNA from strawberries. Okay. So what is the chemical which we used here? That is the chilled ethanol. Okay. And we added this chilled ethanol to precipitate the DNA. And by the spooling method, we took it out. The DNA. Okay. That's it.